What's up, YouTube? And I'm back, man, with another episode of Eminem Network. So today, I'm going to tell you what to expect for when, you you know, you start your training at Spectrum as a field technician. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe. I was at 2,000 subs, but for some reason my channel got deleted, so we starting back over. So make sure you smash that like button and sub if you're new, man, and we're just going to try to get it back. Okay, so... What to expect when you first start training in that spectrum. Right now I'm in week seven. So in week seven is pretty much the final test. After the final test, you go out for uh, two weeks. After your first ride out, cause it's a 10 week total class. So this is week seven. So after this week, I pass the test, we go into week eight. Week eight and nine, you're gonna be riding out and pretty much by yourself. So I will pay attention you know, to what's going on in class because you're gonna be alone. and you gonna want to know what you're doing you feel me so what to expect i would say you know don't be nervous you know try to pay attention to everything because if you've never done something like this before it's gonna be it's gonna be new to you so you ain't gonna know what you're doing you know and um really that's pretty much it man just try to pay attention ask plenty of questions now some things you do are gonna be kind of difficult and then some things not it's gonna be people it's gonna be people that are good at certain things and you know you're going to be good at one thing, they're going to be good at something else. My hardest thing for me probably was when we was doing this, it's called the, uh, it's called wall fishes. Now, the process to do the wall fish is not really hard. It just, you know, if you've never been in an attic before, you know, it might, it might be hard for you because, you know, you ain't never been in an attic. It's hot as hell. Now, it probably won't be hot now because it's starting to cool off. But when I was doing the training for it, you know, it was hot as hell. And then, you know, I'm kind of tall, too. And then they make you wear boots. So when you're wearing boots in the attic, you know, it's not a lot of room to move around. And then up here at the training facility, like the attic that we was in, it was kind of small. So I didn't really have, like, you know, like a lot of room to move around. Plus, it was hot. So I feel like if you come in, in the spectrum training now, you know, with it, you know, being fall and it's going to be cold, it won't be that, you know, be that rough for you. But for me, it was hot as hell, man. i never forget the day we was in the attic. And the trainer told us, you know, to wear knee pads because when you're walking in the attic, it's like little beams you have to step on. And, you know, you want to step on them beams because if you don't step on the beams, you'll fall through the, you know, through the roof or the roof, like I like to say. And you don't want to do that because then you got a damage claim and then they got to come out and then you got to answer all these questions. So, like I said in the beginning of the video, pay attention. Um, what you need to bring, they pretty much give you everything you need. You know, you really don't have to buy anything. They give you all the equipment. I would say try to make sure you have like a pen, but they'll probably give you that too. Like you don't really need to bring anything. Just be ready to work. And just like I always said in the beginning, pay attention, ask plenty of questions. Cause when you get out there in the field, you're going to be out there, you know, by yourself and it's just going to be you. I'm going to be posting some more videos about my experience. Like on the first time I went out on ride alongs. Cause when you first go to ride alongs for the first, it's like it's week three and four. When you first go out on the ride alongs, you with you all you're doing is shadowing so i mean you like helping out but you're not really by yourself but so when i go out to the next time which should be next week i'll be by myself so i'm feeling ready you know i'm just ready to get started but yeah man like i said just pay attention take plenty of notes ask plenty of questions you know and just calm down don't be nervous because i feel like if you really want this you'll be able to do the job but yeah that's all for this video remember to like comment it and subscribe and uh i'll be hit you in the next one i'm out man